the Joker Ditto. Make sure you switch up your tag. Uh, I love it, love it. Both of them using two different outfit variations as well. Um, and this is actually our last winner semis match. Winner of this will go on to fight Mr. E in winner's finals. Um, I'm not, again, best of five. And this is actually our first match on the stream for tonight. That's a uh, battle between SoCal power ranked players. Three, yeah. Right. And both of them just and using a completely jumping. new character, yeah. Let's go. So, I like it. So we'll see what these power ranked players can do with a to totally new character in their hands. Okay, down throw into the fo uh, forward air. And that down tilt, slipper, it kind of looks a lot like. Um, it's like clouds. Simon, uh, yeah, like clouds like Simon too, the yeah. Belmonts as well. <laughs> Which is really yeah. nice. I would just say clouds just because like uh, Simon down tilt has the like second hit once yeah. you connect the first hit. Um, but Cloud Joker Joker doesn't have this. <laughs> no, but you're you're totally right. right. They're they're very similar. The first the first hit of Simon's uh, down tilt. Yeah. That's accurate. All right. Um, but yeah, sweet tea here actually uh, racked, racked up 120 percent on elegant. So it's a little bit harder to tell what moves they're actually throwing out when Arsene is like occupying uh, the yeah. same space as Joker. He's so big that he's like yeah. it's hard to see like For sure. Joker like his character himself. Like, there's two silhouettes behind him. <laughs> oh okay, try to get a read on the landing with the down smash potential air dodge setup. Uh, not gonna work out for Sweet T right there or Elegant Elegance the, uh, the black Joker. The schoolboy joker. Ren Amamiya. I like will. the skins a lot, actually. Yeah, I think they're really cool. So I am okay. a fan. Oh, okay. okay. Alright. I didn't know the up special was using that. What was it? What uh, he, he like kind of used it at a shorter distance. Or maybe I'm just tripping out and it was actually just like a game. Probably not. Oh. oh my gosh, yeah, going for the F smash, but uh... Hot dog there for Sweet T, who's at 183% now, getting tons of mileage on this first stock, on the, excuse me, on Elegant's second stock. Okay, yeah, Elegant, and finding a really hard time closing out the stock. So you see Riddy having him at like almost 80% here. Um, but yeah, it looks like that oh. back throw is going to take it for sure. <laughs> that was fast. So, that was a yeast. So, okay, here. so far I've seen Joker kill with down throw and back throw, but it's uh, definitely like back throw at like 180 by the ledge and down throw at around 180 as well. Um, maybe a little bit higher than that down throw and the forward air. I've yet to see uh, anyone really go for the down throw into the back air setup, but I, know, I do know it's true. Right? Yeah, if you find out any other things to definitely send it in our uh, commentary group chat as well, because it's so interesting finding out um, a lot of the new data and things that the characters have to offer. I'm always I'm still really into a lot about that. Um, it's super fun. This character it just looks mad. Like, he just looks so fun. I'm really excited I'm to like, try him out. I'm super pumped to go try him out. I'm actually probably going to lose some more food which is not a smart idea. Wow, all right, Elegant actually bringing it back here. Uh, has a stock advantage, he is at a high percent, but he's brought that whole stock, he switched it all the way around. Yeah, high percent, man, but Arsene on the field, uh, just about to go out, but with Arsene on the field and this much damage, you got Rage and the stat buff from Arsene. Okay, that should be a That was yep, a nice gimp. utilization of the neutral B down, yep. uh, angling it downwards For there. sure. Almost, it looks like a gift him. <laughs> yeah, it absolutely did. And so we're down to our last stocks right here. Sweet Tea and Elegant, even percents. Both of them about half Rebellion gauge. Down throw into the up air. Great reads here from Elegant. Okay, rolling past the attack attempt. Elegant holding down the stage using Aha by the ledge. Really good spacing from both players right here. Yeah, Sweet Tea actually not getting uh, a lot of hits right now with uh, while he has. I'm wanting to say Aha. <laughs> Wh which which move? The, the whole fan base shadow. Oh, Never. it's uh, Arsen. Arsen, I'm gonna need at least two days. I'm so bad with names, and I always want to say Aha now. Yeah, he actually. Aha is the uh, side special. With Arsen. Ooh, yeah. nice chase yeah. off the stage. Great edge guard coming out from Elegant. Meeting him with the back air and taking game number one. 
I mean, that was pretty close. That was like a really good, like if we were to see any Joker duo here, that was pretty interesting to watch. Yes, like, honestly. absolutely. Honestly, I'm, I wouldn't be surprised if uh, both players just went full Joker right now, like mm -hmm. for the entirety of the set. Uh, they really have nothing to lose since they're both like, you know, have just as much familiarity with the character as one another. Oh, okay. No. It's uh, actually funny no. that Sweet T was like, nah, I'm trying yeah. to win. <laughs> nah. He's like, nah, I'm trying to get that uh, that money for sure. But uh, no, it's funny how they have Sweet T's tag right now. Well. They just have Sweet T. Oh, sweet. <laughs> Sweetie. It's actually Sweet and then a capital yeah. one too afterwards. But that's all right. Game two going to Kalos here, which actually I think this is a better stage pick for Pichu just because uh, Pichu can't stand on the platform and Thunder Jolt camp and um, how to get those like proper edge guarding situations on the ledge or um, Oh, goodness. Okay, Arsene already activated. Let's see how Elegant is going to make use of it. Those ledge trapping situations. Oh, wow. And um, something I yet to talk about yet. I mean, I know I've mentioned like his specials change, his attacks get stronger, uh, but the gun actually becomes gun special. And when Arsene is out and you use the neutral special, it uh, actually shoots three bullets as opposed to the one that it does when Wait, Arsene is not activated. Was that a down tilt there? That uh, just kind of so, scooped him. Yeah. Oh, deep chase with the neutral air, not enough to get the stock. He should be able to make it back using the grappling. Yeah, hook. the grapple action has a long reach. Pretty it kind of reminds yeah. me of Ivysaur's. Yes, uh, absolutely. And I've yet to see if it really has like a dead spot like Ivysaur, so it might actually be better than Ivysaur's uh, tether. And uh, actually, Elegant's kind of making it a little bit difficult for Suki to get this tilt confirmed. He can't really go throw his F tilt as much or his aerial options because he's really mixing up his movement with the dash and dash out options. Arsene about to be online. He gets that neutral air and it does reset the meter. Oh, okay. Or no, maybe it activated while he was like flying. Yeah, it probably activated as he was flying into the blast zone. And if it's activated, if you lose it, uh, no. You're not going to come back with Arsene. That would be a little busted. Yeah. <laughs> that would be busted for sure. But all right, yeah. Arsene is activated again. And always, like, it, it kind of makes, like, I feel like if I was fighting against the Joker, the hitbox, would, like, it would kind of mess me up a little bit. Cause it makes it look like there's two big hitboxes now. For you might, sure. with, when things are happening and moving way too fast, you might be accidentally like misspacing yeah. things. Like it, de it definitely uh, makes it tricky. And of course, you got to remi uh, remember that the, uh, Arsene has, is completely invincible. So you don't want to ever actually attack Arsene. So you can't really do anything to it. Yeah, something to keep in mind. Did right Elephant um, DI in there? Is that why? Uh, probably. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not really sure what he got hit by right there. But nonetheless, Sweet T actually in a really good spot right here to take this game too. Uh, and I actually really like the stage that he went to as well. Kalos made, like the widest stage on our uh, move, uh, on our stage list, with the exception of Mementos uh, for tonight. I'm not sure if uh, Tutti is going to keep Mementos legal for a while, if it's just for tonight. I know it's for tonight at the very least. Yeah, I definitely kind of mentioned earlier why I think some, there's a few reasons why I think it actually probably won't be legal. Um, but I mean, we might have it for a couple days. For this as well. we'll make it oh, fun. okay. Grab here for Elegant. Still massive deficit right here. Trying to read the agility with the up smash. That should be the stock right there. Down smash. Connecting for Sweet T and taking game number one with two stocks. Yeah, Elegant is down smash. With uh, Pikachu actually looking, uh, hitbox actually looks yeah. a little bigger for Pikachu. It's, down smash. it's hard, uh, as I was mentioning earlier on in the stream. Like it does, it definitely seems <coughs> like Joker struggles against these more uh, nimble characters, the, the characters with the superior Luigi. frame data. And Elliot is going to make the switch to Luigi and Sweet Tea, going back to the Pokemon trainer as well. Probably just for the rest of the set, we're just gonna see their their, their normal characters. Like well, probably, I, um, probably no more Joker. I do know that that's exactly why Jacob knew he was gonna switch right. uh, if to Luigi, lost, yeah. and that he was gonna switch Pokemon Trainer. Right. I know CT uh, actually does like this matchup for Pokemon Trainer for specific reasons too. Getting Luigi off stage, going for those downers, and I feel like just overall, it's easier to uh, utilize Razor Leaf certain options against Luigi. Perfect stock coming out from Sweet T, able to take that first stock. Oh, unfortunately, Elegant flubbing his combo right there, not gonna get the kill set that he wanted. Uh, Sweet T making uh, quick work of this. All right, up smash oh, coming out for Elegant too. 
But yeah, the Ivysaur pick is definitely great against Luigi. Uh, the recovery for Luigi, um, not as great as it was in Smash 4, as we mentioned earlier, and it's very linear, so it's very easy for um, Luigi to gimp him if he can line up the uh, down air off stage as well. But down throw into the down special. Uh, we're gonna see a lot of that coming out from Elegant. We've seen a lot of it already. Uh oh, this is bad. Right? Oh, oh okay. Yeah, I'm not, not sure what happened. Yeah, yeah he's kind of just like maybe he thought he was gonna like stick into the stage or maybe not have to jump. I didn't really even get to see what happened there. It was kind of like the stage blocked it. <laughs> yeah. Kinda yeah, that tends to happen with the Pokemon Stadium camera as well. Uh, a little bit hard I just to had see. a total deja vu. It was really weird. <laughs> What was that grab? He was able to grab him out of the tornado hitbox uh, with the pivot grab, really smart play by Sweet T. He had already gone for it once. Uh, the first time he actually got beat out by the tornado hitbox. Uh, Is it tornado or hurricane? What's the proper name of that move? I'm, I'm just gonna call it Either tornado. Either or, I feel like people aren't gonna be like, wow, that move's no, hurricane. What no, you for mean? sure, but I can. <laughs> that is true, it's good to know, but I mean, either or. That's pretty much the same. I'll call it Tornado for now, and then I'll, I'll, I'll uh, verify it. That fireball canceling out yeah, a flare blitz. Back throw. Yo, back throw. A little Very fireball strong. canceling out a flare blitz. Like a dragon momentum. <laughs> funny. Fireballs <laughs> are OP. <laughs> no, they are. I mean, I'm telling you, the projectiles in this game are a scary thing. Like I was mentioning earlier, uh, Pichu's Thunder Jolt and Pikachu's Thunder Jolt are probably one of the best projectiles in the game. In my opinion, I just think they're ridiculous and do good damage and um, definitely mess up a lot of combo strings and it makes it difficult. You gotta, you're gotta, you kind of like forcing your opponent to force for sure. in a tricky situation. So we, we are seeing Pokemon Stadium 2 again. Sweet T with the advantage 2-1 to one here in this set. Uh, he is on game point on the verge of potentially making winner's finals and meeting up against Mr. E. See if he can do it, or if Elegant has a bit more of a read. He did have two unfortunate stocks at the beginning where he wasn't able to touch. Sweet T got uh, completely obliterated on that first stock, and then uh, as beat on the second one. Oh, this is really bad. He's probably dead. Wow. Yes. Wow. Okay, that was a good nair off okay. stage. Then utilizing uh, Ivysaur's huge hitbox down air or hitbox down air. Which, oh my God. What wow. A doesn't setup. even matter though. Elegant responding back. Yeah. Um, and really, Jesus. really smart from Elegant too. He got the down throw into the turnaround up air, which positioned him to like get back that back air follow up. Otherwise, if he had not turned around the up air, he would not have been able to uh, utilize that Thank combo. Yeah, I didn't get to see all the <laughs> what it was actually that happened, but um, yeah, Elegant answering back really quickly. Yo, oh, what? what, dude? He just went for down what throw up special. The fact Come that on. that almost worked and almost killed him. Almost, yeah, for sure. So. Uh, Elegant already turning his luck but right back around, but Sweet T just having the read on these tornado approaches. Yeah. Oh, beautiful Nair again. Down throw to up B as well, which is massive damage. Yeah. And almost killing um, at 80% there. Yeah. And uh, Sweet T getting that game off stage again with the neutral air is such a strong tool. If he doesn't, if he's not able to find the KO with the neutral air, it, at the very least, oh, gifts right there. Nice. Uh, Elegant putting yeah. himself right back into this even game situation down to our last stock right here. Final opportunity for Elegant to bring this back to a game number five. Dash attack, okay, good damage for him. This is a really good spot for Elegant. Uh-oh, fine whip into the up air. Oh, that grab, barely out of reach there. Probably what Elegant needed. Um, Sweetie playing a little bit safe out of his... Um, Go two frames. Racing zone, oh my god. Yeah. Uh, this is down to the wire right here. Of course, Sweet T one more confirm, and he makes his way into winner's final. Elegant looking for this KO to bring himself back into the set. He's at 102%. He's got to tread very carefully right now. He's uh, fading back with these fireballs, pressuring with the forward where he can. He gets the read off the ledge. Elegant's like, oh, you got a projectile? I got a projectile too. Just doing the same thing as Sweet T's doing here, throwing out his. Uh, Oh, is that going to confirm? Into the tornado. Not enough. Still alive. But takes the percent lead. Oh my gosh, this is so scary. So many options going out. Both players really just scared yeah. to uh, move in here. Absolutely. Playing their heart out right now. 
Uh oh, grab not gonna work out. Back air out of shield, going to be really good. The down air, such a massive threat for Elegant right now. Yo, the charge forward smash, and that's gonna do it. Wow. Sweet T taking the set three to one over Elegant. Yo, that was crazy at the end there. I was getting so nervous trying not to like bite my nails. Um, but yeah, that was. That tornado option there at the end really was what Elegant was counting on. And the fact yeah. that that didn't connect, just, yeah, gave Jay 